Ah, what a wonderful day to do nothing. Oh, and I just remembered. It's time to ask Della to pay her rent. Ah, uh, I love watching reality TV show. Give me money! Damn it, I forgot today was payday. Della, you owe me $420. You said $410. Did I? Oh well, I increased it. Besides, it's only just an additional $10. Anyways, uh, pay up. Unless you want to get kicked out. Well, I'm short $10 because you just increased the price. What's this? I said I want $430. Stop increasing the price by $10. Fine, but you better pay back by the end of next week. Time to sit down and do nothing again. What do you want? Uh, hello, Varric. For the thousandth time, my name is Ares. Whatever. Look, today is Chris's birthday, and Chris has been asking a lot of questions about their absent father, so you need to come over today. Just tell them that I left to get the milk. I already told them that. Oh, well, uh, too bad, because I'm still not coming over. Oh, really? Then give me at least one reason why you can't come. I'm a bounty hunter. I'm a very busy man. Farrick, it's not fair that Chris doesn't get to see their own biological father for their birthday. Okay? So please just come over for at least a little bit. What's in it for me if I come over? <sighs> I'll pay you $10. Sounds like a deal to me. you guys get over here now all right listen up everybody i have sadly been coerced into going into my biological child's birthday so i am getting paid ten dollars for this and i want some of you guys to come with me who's gonna go to the birthday party with me uh not me uh i mean i guess i'll go I don't really have too much things to do today. Well, I, I can't go. I'm ashamed of what I look like under my mask. What do you look like under your mask anyways? That's none of your business, woman. Show us, show us, show us, show us, show us. No! Now everyone's going to know I look like Danny DeVito. Uh, don't be ashamed. It could have been worse. I can't believe you took my mask off in front of everyone when I specifically said I didn't want anyone to know what was under my mask. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't help myself. Well, now I'm definitely not going to the birthday party because I'm on my way to get plastic surgery. Last chance, is anyone else coming? I'm leaving now. I'm not going to a crappy birthday party. You are terrible at whistling. Anyways, shall we go to the birthday party now? Uh, duh. I want to get my $10. Now let's go, Carl. Okay, Chris. I have a very special surprise for you. He should be on his way right now. You asked Toriel if it was your biological father. You'll have to wait and see. Oh, Chris, that must be them. Why don't you go answer the door? You want to go answer the door? Hide me, Carl. You asked Toriel why Jean Pierre Paul Nareth is at your door. I'm not Paul Nareth, although he is my cousin. <laughs> Stop having a seizure. Hello, uh, Aries. Who is your friend here? My name is Carl Karras. It is nice to meet you. It's a pleasure to meet you, Carl. I'm Toriel. 
Rask tutorial if Jean Pierre Paul Nerf was your biological father. No, I am, sadly. Don't be rude. But Carl, she's my ex. Don't you dare but Carl me. When we get home, you'll get an ass whooping. You said Ayo, invisible confusion. Why don't you two just come inside? Damn, you don't have any friends? Now, now, Chris has plenty of friends. One of them just couldn't make it to the party. Chris, where is, uh, Susie? You said that Susie was on a date with Noel. Well, there you have it. Now then, I better go check up on the pie. I'll leave you three to talk it out. Last your biological father, how he met Toriel? Well, it all started at the club.